love him. And you're already setting yourself apart from some of the most violent opposition you'll encounter. Because you love him. Because you revere King Jesus. Because you devote your life to serving King Jesus. You recognize that everything you think you own actually belonged to him first. And it will be his when you're gone. You will recognize that everywhere you go, every breath you breathe, every word that comes out of your mouth is a gift from King Jesus. And they ought to be devoted to him. At least in spirit. So being an insurgent means radical devotion to King Jesus for the sake of his kingdom. And so it is. Now, what does that look like in real life? Well, I've just finished reading a couple of biographies. You know, I read all the time. And, well, you know, you probably want your pastor to be somebody who reads a lot. But, you know, I could read comic books. You know, you've got to be a little more specific about what I'm reading if you're going to encourage me to read. But as it turns out, I'm a sucker for those fat books full of vast knowledge that bore a lot of people. But anyway, <laughs> I just finished reading the biography of Martin Luther which was recommended to me by Julie Silkwood. And then I followed that author to his book on Dietrich Bonhoeffer. These guys were insurgents. I mean, literally and figuratively. They were insurgents for the sake of the kingdom of Jesus Christ.